Hello guys and welcome back. It's been one year since I opened this YouTube channel and started working on my game. But in the past few days, I thought, okay, I'm making this game. I have this beautiful community and everything, but something is missing. I'm kind of not involving you guys as much as I wanted. So I'm gonna make an announcement. I decided to make a challenge with you. As an extra work for the next 30 days, I'm planning on making one item per day. And by item, I mean anything that can be used in this game. I don't know, like um, a tree, a type of food, uh, of course crocs because it's, i mean crocs are always welcome and the point is that you can decide what this item will be what you have to do is just join the discord server or if you don't want you can just leave a comment somewhere with a little description of the item you think would fit in the game please if you want to have any chance to be picked write something that makes sense uh don't say like i don't know put elon Musk in your game I mean, yeah, he's a cool guy and everything, but I don't know if he would fit in a survival game. <laughs> Maybe he would with a pair of Crocs, but that's because of the Crocs, not because of him. Anyway, that was the idea. I hope you get it and you're interested somehow, but let's start with today, double look. So, I'm gonna introduce you a new type of island. Uh, it was heavily inspired by this astronaut screenshot, so I started thinking, how can I do something like this? And since a lot of you ask me how I model stuff, I decided to show it. Well, I started with a standard island model and basically I created a sort of sphere which I'm gonna use to kinda dig inside the island. And the trick is to use a boolean modifier and start subtracting it a few times and after a while you should get this result. You can iterate this as much as you want. Okay, um, but what about the island itself? It's a rare one, it's probably gonna be the rarest one. Um, is it because I'm lazy and I don't want to create too much of them? No, or maybe, but the main reason is because in here you can find some rare materials. And I know it's a bit of a cliche, but here you can find diamonds. Well, that's not really the only place where you can find them, but here you have a high probability. Right now, diamonds are used in powder form to make stuff more resistant to the weather and everything. So let's say you have an airship. If you want to go to an island in a high altitude zone with a high pressure, without diamonds, you just can't. Otherwise, it will break. I'm sorry, I didn't have sound effects. Another thing you can find here, it's a plant. Uh, well, it's actually a mushroom that grows on this plant and it has the highest healing properties. Well, right now it's not really useful because you cannot hurt yourself if you don't starve or anything. But when I will add creatures that can hurt you, then it's gonna be different. You're gonna beg to have one of these. One more thing, as all the other materials, the diamonds has to be pickaxed. So it's time to make it in ore form. And to do that, I used Blender. As always, I started with a cube and cr I created the main shape by bisecting it. And then I added some details, extruding parts and using a modifier to create those little cracks you see on the rock. Then I created some strips so the player knows that this is a diamond ore. And that was done with a knife tool and extruding them along the normals. All right, here it is in Unity. You can see that the color is a little bit dull, pretty much like my life. So I guess at some point I will have to write a custom shader. Um, a little bonus for this video, I really like Easter eggs. So I was thinking of making something like this giant diamond ore that really gives you a ton of diamond if you break it. But of course, as an Easter egg, the possibilities to find it are going to be tiny. Uh, so tell me in the comments what do you think if it could work or not. As you can tell, the new island type is pretty empty because right now there are only two items you can find in. So I guess for the next few days, I will have to work on this. And if you want to participate to the challenge, you can also suggest something that suits to this island. Uh, I mean, you can say everything. It does not have to be found in here. Just remember, it has to be done in one day. Well, the contents I had for this devlog are finished, so I really thank you for watching, and I'm gonna end this video with a crock storm. 